<clears throat> Hello ladies and gentlemen, Groovy Guy here and welcome to today's video where we're going to be having a look at eHobbies Magna Convoy. Now if you're familiar with Transformers at all you'll know this is just a straight repaint of Generation, no, Classics Optimus Prime. So there's nothing really new to the toy except he's got a couple of different accessories. He's got well, these are accessories borrowed from other molds. We've got uh, mind wipe sort of tail slash double barrel gun thing. Um, it's not really much to say about it. He does use this in the comics a couple of times as a gun. Uh, but it can also be used as a hand protector for the Matrix Sword. Uh, this is an accessory from Alpha Trion, I believe. Titans Returns Alpha Trion. And it's a really nice uh, repaint of it. Just clear blue or transparent light blue. Solid gold. And it looks pretty cool. Uh, there's no way that I can see to actually incorporate these two accessories into the truck mode. Uh, I think the closest I came was just uh, Da, 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 da. Sort of doing that and then just sticking it on the back like that. <laughs> so, yeah. He's a nice little repaint. He's got an interesting story to him. He comes with two comics. Uh, one is a comic that's sort of typical of the Legends releases. And another one is a grittier story where this guy was like a clone trooper from what I can see and then he was imbued with sentience by part of their falling leader who looked like big mammoth convoy or something and yeah basically he just ends up taking the mantle of leadership and then they try to reassemble the Primus Vanguard from what I can see in the comic is a bit um, confusing he's also really good friends with Convo Bat Hello. Uh, so yeah it looks like Convo Bat has a nice little companion piece now so yeah he's got a really nice Autobot decal on his wind shear thingy uh, yeah, not really doing much for the whole Robots in Disguise lark, but it's a really nice looking uh, truck mode, even though it's been seen several times before. It's nice uh, silver smokestack slash gun, nice little silver grill and front bumper. Anyway, there's enough of a look at his vehicle mode. Let's go to his robot mode. Okay, and we're back with Magna Convoy in his robot mode. Uh, yeah, again, as before, if you're familiar with the Optimus Prime mode, you're familiar with this mode. The only difference is this guy doesn't have light piping. He's got a solid all plastic black head and he's got yellow painted eyes. If he wants to get in a focus. No, okay. Don't have to get into focus if you don't want to. I wouldn't want you to make any sacrifices. Jesus. All right, so he doesn't want to get into focus, which is okay. I already got a focus one of him for the thumbnail. Um, I haven't put any accessories on him yet, and that's just because he uses his accessories in several different ways in such a short, short time. So the way the instructions have him uh, sort of transformed and or displayed is by having the gun or the two guns sort of combined. So he's got the over the shoulder cannons and then he just holds the mind wipe gun in one hand. He's got very very tight uh, grips on everything so it's got me a bit worried and then he holds his sword 
that hand there. So he's that way he's at least using all of his uh, accessories. Um, but there's a more interesting way you can incorporate all of the accessories. So one way is to take the mind wipe gun, fold it in half. For some reason, I've got really bad QC on this. If I fold it out, is it going to pop out again? You see this joint or this little pop up thing here? The black part. Now he wants to get in focus. The black part keeps uh, winding off the blue peg. So it's a bit weird. I think the, pl the black plastic is a little bit warped. Just a little bit. So anyway, what you can do is we spin the sword around. Spin the sword around. Fold that up like that. You can peg. Oh, hang on. Might have to actually put that down. Peg that in there. Now he's got sort of like a hand guard for the sword, which I think is a pretty cool little touch. And then he can have... You have this gun as a blaster. And again, QC issues. The uh, little black part likes to keep popping off. And what are we going to fold these bits out? So really get your nail in there for this guy. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Fold that up. Clip it all together. And then he's holding that gun in that hand like that. And then he's got. Where are we? Come on. There you go. Then he's got his shield in the back. He is shown in the comic a few times to have the shield on his back. And then during a fight, someone sneaks up behind him. And let's just say he ends up having a... Well, the guy trying to do the sneak attack ends up being dispatched by the big cannon. Ugh. Boy, these joints are really, really tight. Ends up being dispatched eh, by the big cannon. So that's a really nice touch. If I can get it all in shot, let's move it up a bit. So yeah, Magna Convoy. The comic really, really shows him sort of using all the accessories in ways that the, the toy can, but I don't think is really being used in any of the fiction before so he's interesting I wouldn't go uh, out of my way too drastically to get him he's a very niche sort of one-off character I think a um, couple of comparisons here he is with his buddy Magna Convoy Let's see if I can get them a bit centered yeah there he is with Magna Convoy uh, here he is with his, uh, Japanese original use, Henke Convoy. Um, what else have we got? We've got, uh, Leader Class Megatron. Still got this guy out for my Optimus Prime video. So yeah, definitely a good Voyager scale figure. Um, unique character. Uh, if you're interested in collecting toys of unique characters that none of your Transformers uh, unfamiliar friends would not have never heard of, definitely hunt him down. Um, he is a really nice piece to look at. Um, the blue is very, very relaxing to look at and I feel very relaxed looking at it uh, so yeah there's a quick look at Magna Convoy uh, he's pretty much just like uh, Convo Bat he's repaints and reuses of figures we already have and just sort of 
unique characters are created regarding them. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope you found it informative. This is a very, very uh, niche video. I honestly forgot I was looking for him and then uh, I think it was Tim got in touch with me on the Ozformers uh, collection board and said, hey, you still after Convo? Uh, not Convo, Magna Convoy. And I said, yeah. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's uh, been an interesting ride with this guy. Uh, coming up next, I'll see if I can get a preview of him. Da -da 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 -da. Blackout incoming. So I look forward to that, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye now.